What is going on my broskies? My name is Toadskin. I'm back again here to bring you guys yet another One Piece Treasure Cruise video. And in today's video, we have a pretty crazy bit of information where there is another Sugo Fest coming out on the Japan version of One Piece Treasure Cruise where they're introducing the Quick Striker lore which will be debuting along with a new legend which is going to be a brand new legend Luchi. Now before we get into this guys, first thing is first I just want to say I'm not a big fan of them recreating this specific Luchi and the reason for that is he is strikingly similar to his already red strength six star form and i'm really confused as to why they did this i mean i really wanted another luchi legend personally but i hate the fact that he is also a powerhouse related legend i really wish he was something else but anyways let's get into all the details and i'll give my further opinions after that so uh, let's get straight into the video so I'd like to introduce you guys to the brand new 6 star Sugo Fest exclusive Legend Luchi. So this guy here is a quick unit. Now as of me recording the commentary right now, I don't know what the classes are. If I do know them, I'll put them on the video or in the comment section down below. But from what we can see of this unit so far, we're all assuming he's going to be a shooter powerhouse type character. He's definitely a powerhouse character of course, but uh, we don't know what his secondary class would be. Uh, just ju judge, but Judging by the leaked information of his special animation it definitely looks like he's going to be a shooter character but let's go ahead and break down these guys abilities so his captain ability will boost the attack of powerhouse characters by 2.5 times and will also boost their hp by 1.2 times and he will also halve the recovery of your crew then on top of that every time you hit a consecutive perfect the attack of your powerhouse characters will increase by a further 1.1 times and that will max at 4.026 times so just off the bat i think that his captain ability is much better than his strength counterpart his strength legend counterpart uh the strength version talking about his six star plus version uh will boost the attack by 2.5 and then 3.5 if you have a matching orb so uh, in most cases when you're doing your burst turn against enemies you are going to be having a full board of orbs or close to a full board of orbs so that already will give you a lot of damage output now the thing about legend luchi is you don't require to have you know the matching orbs to do a lot of damage and uh at least two or three of your units are going to be above the attack multiplier of the previous Legend Luchi. And the thing about this Legend Luchi that I like, the quick one, is the fact that he doesn't completely remove all of, all of your crew's recovery. You only get half recovery of your crew. And on top of that, you get a small 1.2 times HP boost. So I really like that about his captain ability. Uh, because you do get a little bit of tankiness and a little bit of wiggle room with his captain ability. As you do get a little bit more health and that recovery boost. Uh, so it just means that recovery orbs aren't completely useless with this Legend Luchi. Uh, and just partnering this guy up with the Rocket Man ship is going to set you on your way. Getting you lots and lots of recovery back on your crew. So uh, I think his captain ability personally is better when you compare the two legend luchis but now let's talk about his special ability so once again we don't know all the details right now so i don't really know what his special cooldown is his initial and max cooldown at, at the current time but we do know what he actually does so his special ability will make it so that for two turns it reduces the defense of all enemies drastically now when it says drastically we don't know the exact value if i had to guess it says drastically so it could be a 100 percent defense reduction i doubt it though if I had to guess, it's going to be probably like 80 or 90% uh, defense reduction, which is still pretty solid. Although defense reduction isn't really that used in One Piece Treasure Cruise. It's not really a big thing. Uh, not too many times you'll need to reduce the defense of enemies. Some niche enemies, some niche dungeons will need it. But for the most part, it's not really too much to really talk about there. Um, and it will do extra large typeless damage to all enemies. So, you know, probably a 60 times multiplier or higher maybe. Um, that's still not too bad. It is AoE damage, which is pretty nice. And it will make all powerhouse characters have a matching orb, which is pretty freaking solid. And it will heal 20% of your crew's current HP. That's really, really good. That's an amazing special ability. Uh, once again, I'm going to be comparing him to his previous uh, legend character. So when you compare the two, they both basically give orbs to your characters. The thing about Luchi, though, is he's a little bit slower because you can't use your matching orb abilities right away unless if you have an orb shuffle 
Uh, but with this guy, all your powerhouse characters get matching orbs no matter what. And on top of that, you get a 20% HP heal, which is pretty good. I really wish it was maybe a little bit more, or maybe like a certain times his recovery would have been a, a really good, a really good thing. Um, so you could give him recovery candies. But still, this is pretty nice. 20% um, health is actually pretty nice. And because you have uh, increased health because of his captain ability, you will be recovering a little bit more from this guy as well. Uh, and the defense reduction, as I mentioned before, isn't really too much of a of a thing to really talk about there. Um, but yeah, comparing him to his regular six star form, the six star form is uh, the regular uh, strength one is a little bit slower. This guy will give you the stuff that you need right away. Um, but you know, obviously with the strength one, there are ways to get your orbs straight away. Uh, so yeah, it re it is really hard, and it is really strange to think why they would bring out another legend Luchi that is so similar to his previous strength one. I really do not understand it. Uh, I mean, when you compare it to some of the other six star characters that have had duplicates of their character get a six star form, like Log Luffy and Timeskip Luffy and Gear 4, those guys all have vastly different abilities. Um, obviously, Timeskip Luffy and Gear 4 Luffy being slightly different, but when they released Timeskip Luffy, uh, Taisuke Luffy, he was vastly different to Log Luffy, and then with the new Boa that came out recently, her abilities are completely different from her previous 6-star form, and then Law, of course. The previous 6-star Law being a slasher and free spirit related legend, whereas the other Law is a striker based legend. So, I don't get why this time they've gone ahead and made him, you know, so, so similar. It is really crazy why they would do that. I do not understand it. For me personally, I would have loved to see the Legend Luchi, this current one that, ca that got released, be maybe a driven based captain or even a shooter based character. I mean, you know, we just had the new Boa that, you know, was shooter based, but even make this guy a shooter. I wouldn't mind about that. Um, but yeah, I think a driven character would have been really cool for Legend Luchi as well. So yeah, that's pretty much all the stuff that we know right now. If we get any more information regarding his stats or anything else, I'll leave it in the comment section down below so uh, you guys can go ahead and have a look. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. And if you guys did enjoy it, make sure to smack the like button down below. And if you want to stay up to date with all of the content I post on my channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. But other than that, guys, I will see you guys within the next video.